Patricia. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be transforming my apartment office into the Pinterest office of my dreams. I'm so excited to share it with you guys today and take you guys on the journey of me trying to figure out if I can make this office what I have pictured and planned out in my head. So I'm going to start by showing you guys just an overview of my very messy, very chaotic office and then hopefully at the end it comes out pretty much how I want it. If you guys are interested in anything that I am showing you today, I'll have all of the items and products pretty much linked down below. If there's something that I didn't link, please let me know and I'll be happy to share where I got it from. I'm very excited. We've lived in this apartment now for about two and a half months and this is the only room that is not fully complete. I still have boxes in the corner that needs to be unpacked and need to put things together. We are going to start by putting together a like 16 cube organizer shelf thing that I bought and we are going to get started. Oh man, I hope this comes out how my brain is picturing it to come out. And I don't know if I like my bandana today. I haven't decided. My ears are tucked in. I'm not used to that. But look, my, my socks have cows on them. Fun, right? I have my helper Theo here and we're going to make this office my dream office. sweating. <sighs> so this is my big cube organizer that I'm going to try my best to put together. We will see how it goes. But this is also the carpet I got for the room. It's not going to fit the entire room, but it's this really pretty like nude um, it looks browner on camera, but it is more of just like a neutral, like, tan and white rug. And again, this is the organizer. It is very large. I mean, it weighs probably more than I do. And if we're, if we're looking at this thing like this, right? Okay. This is large. I'm going to try my best to put this together. Angel's at his parents doing laundry right now for us. So I'm going to try and see how well I can put this together while the room is drying after I just mopped it. So best of luck to me. <laughs> All right, so I stopped filming to take everything out of this huge box. And one, I found something very cool. With my purchase from Walmart, thanks Walmart and Better Homes and Gardens, I get a one year subscription to Better Homes and Gardens magazine. Cool, so I'm gonna fill that out for sure is because I love a free magazine. However, I don't know when Angel will come back. So my original plan was to build everything out here, kind of like in my front door area, and then just move it with his help. But I think for my own sanity and for convenience, <laughs> it would be best if I just built it in my office. So I don't know how dry the floors are, I'm going to go check on that now. Hopefully they're probably dry, but we'll build it in there and try. There's only like four, five, six, six pieces and then like the cube shelves itself. So hopefully it's not too difficult and it doesn't take me too long and then I can start getting the rest of the stuff in there. That's really heavy. 
cousin to get something. I'm at a standstill with the blinds, or not the blinds, oh my, the curtains. I'm at a standstill with the curtains until Angel can come back with the drill, um, so I'm kind of paused on that. I think what I'm going to do is set up my little coffee station printer area over here. That is the next plan of action. However, guys, I want to show you. I put a couple of more things over here. It's not fully decorated. I'm not fully finished with it all yet, but this shelf. Huh. This shelf, I'm already obsessed with it. It looks so good. I showed my aunt and she was like, wow, that's really, really cute. This is what we are working with right now. I am obsessed. My brother got me this light box, which I need to like find a place or how to plug it in. But I just looked up that quote. It said, Bloomer, you are planted. And I'm going to stick some Polaroids up there. I put my picture up here of my watercolor monster, which I got from a local shop. I'm obsessed with it. And then I put my sign that I got down here when I went to the Goodwill a little while ago. It's from Pottery Barn, but I love it. And the baskets just make it in my huge Monstera on top. I could not be more happy with how this is turning out. It looks so good. Like I said, I think I'm going to start with putting up some of my coffee area station things over here. And then I'm going to throw my desk back in here because I'm pretty sure... It's not going to be in the way over here. And then my new plan is I want to hang up my calendar on this part of the wall over here. I just think that chunk area needs something, and I think that um, calendar will do it. Okay, you guys can't even tell, like, over camera how awesome this looks. But my printer does still work. Oh, I unplugged it. <laughs> it does work, though. I did just plug it in. I wiped it all down and everything. I need ink, but she works. And then I just stuck my little Keurig over here. I'm washing the bottom part of it right now, so it's not super dirty. And now I have my little turntable right here. Ah, I do have more coffee for it, so I'll put some more coffee and stuff in here. And everything reaches, and then this whole little corner. Oh my god, I could die. It's so cozy. I, I am obsessed. I can't wait until I have the curtain up here. It's gonna look so good. So I'm gonna look at my desk and put my desk in here now and start getting some more of this stuff on this wall situated. All right, desk is in. I am going to um, take a break. My old 25 year, 25 year old back hurts really bad. So I'm gonna rest my back. <laughs> And then when Angel comes back, I will continue in here with y'all. You're a thicker screwdriver. 
All right, guys, it is the next weekend. I don't know if I should look at the camera like this or look in the mirror like this. I'm gonna go with the mirror. This feels more comfortable. It's the next weekend. Obviously, you can see now we have hung my amazing mirror. I love it so much. It looks so great. We also finally got the curtain all hung up. That was a whole project in itself. I don't know why it was so difficult. We really, really struggled getting the curtain all set. We could not get the curtain rod, like, what's that called? Like the hardware that actually goes into the wall. We couldn't get it in the um, paneling, uh, like, the, like the trim or whatever. We couldn't get it in. We don't know why it was so hard. We ended up using nails to get it in because it wouldn't go in any other way. Now we're gonna do a couple of final things. I have a couple of shelves that I bought when we first moved in that we're gonna stick in the corner over over there just to match the height with the huge monstera over here just to make it make a little bit more sense and then after that i'm going to um decorate it all pretty and cute tomorrow but it looks so great in here i'll give you a quick little preview of what we're looking like so this is what we are working with in this corner this corner is absolutely amazing i love it it makes me so happy we have our curtain hung here and i don't think i mentioned before but the plastic on the windows is to help with keeping the cold air out and the warm air in and help that stop going off all the time because it goes off a ton and then i have my lamp all situated my poster's not falling down anymore but we're really coming together and really looking good these shelves here in that corner order that's the project and then we can decorate all tomorrow and make it all cute <sighs> Day three, let's finish this office because I'm sick of saying I need to finish my office. I have this big old box here of stuff I need to put out, get together, whatever. I'm so sick of looking at it, I need to just put all this stuff away. I want to straighten that up a little bit, make it look a little cuter. Basically, just, we're adding the cute parts today. We're making the office look cute. I have this little sign down here that I got from TJ Maxx yesterday for the date and stuff. I think that's so cute, I wanna set that up and put it somewhere else on here. We have to hang these lights as well. We went out just now and bought some command hooks because my idea is I wanna put it along the top of here and make it look nice, straighten up my plants and everything. And what else do I have to do? Oh, we also went to Bath and Body Works and I got some nice new candles. This is the mahogany coconut one that I'll have out in here and this one which is Fiji White Sands and it smells wonderful. Oh, I also think I'm going to put a different plant up there, but the shelves look great. They look so nice. I love them. You can kind of see a little better the bulbs that we're talking about that's on the wall here. So we really had to figure that out when hanging those because I really didn't want them over here, but they look great. All right, we're going to empty out this box. That's what I want to start with. So we're going to do that first. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What's up guys, we are here with Patty P. She is putting the final touches to her office. She, we just took the thing off for one plant. The thing? Well, you know the thing that holds plants, that's woody, 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 stringy type. It's got a new, a new trunk to grow in. There's a famous poster. <laughs> it's got a pencil mark on it, I should probably erase that. <laughs> I think this is the, the setup I'm gonna go with. Over here with my plants. I have my most prized um, monsteras in here, and this little Thai constellation monstera that I got. So freaking cute! I love it so much. So Angel's gonna help me. We're gonna hang up the lights along here.
my god you guys i am so excited this office is finished we have no idea since we've been moved in here it's been like i don't know three months and i have been having these big grand old plans for my office and i have not been able to complete them and i'm so happy that it's done i have so much more content coming this year for you guys you have no idea this week alone is going to be crazy for me so be sure you subscribe and stay tuned so you can see what's going to happen please tell me about your office or if you like this office i think this video is important because i don't live in a, like a traditional apartment complex i live in like a double house top is rented the bottom is rented and we're in the bottom and this is a very old house this house is over 100 years old so there's definitely things that i can't fix about it but i love it i'm absolutely obsessed with how it turned out it is like the pinterest office of my dreams with all the plants and all the cute decorations and everything it just makes my heart so so happy so again if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and tell me what your favorite part of it was down below please check the description box if you're interested in anything i'll have most everything that i can linked down below for you guys or if you want to know where something else is from please ask and i will gladly tell you and uh, I don't know. I love this office. Stay tuned because I'm going to be in this office a whole lot more and I can't wait to add even more fun and cute plant amazing green things to it. <laughs> it makes my heart so happy. So thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.